today I have a big giant grocery haul. This is a Walmart pickup and a trip to Aldi's. So let's hop right in. All right, let's start over here with some Aldi stuff. Cookies for my husband and the boys probably. Some shortening for baking. This is a little pepperoni calzone for my husband. Some fat-free refried re beans. Nutty bars. Found these little um, sweet potato and broccoli bites that the boys might try out. They're not vegan, they have eggs in them. But maybe we'll be able to get them since they're like dinosaur shapes. <laughs> And a couple little guacamoles. I love these restaurant style guacamole. Park Street Deli is the brand. These are super duper good um, from Aldi. Salsa, big giant thing of salsa. I eat salsa and chips like there's no tomorrow. Massive thing of olive oil because I ordered the smaller one but apparently they were out so they replaced it with this massive thing. Couple packs of Crescent rolls, we like to use those in various things for like our um, super simple Monday and Tuesday night dinners. These regular old like white sub rolls, my husband really likes those for like meatball subs or Philly cheesesteak sandwiches or whatever. Got a crescent roll sheet. I like to use that for like breakfast pizza or that's mostly, that's mostly what I use it for actually. I wanted to try a couple of these little Kite Hill yogurts. I always hear really good things about Kite Hill. So I got a blueberry and a strawberry one. And the boys really love yogurt too. So I'm sure we'll all just share those together. Pepperoni for my husband. Tomorrow we're going to have pizza crescent rolls. Some tofu. A couple packs of smart dogs, vegan hot dogs, and a pack of regular hot dogs for my husband. And some sausage, this is different packaging. This is Italian tofurkey sausage. I was thinking about making like a pasta with like little bites of this in there and then freezing it and using it for like days I don't have a lot of time to make lunch. A Dea pizza, which is exciting at my Walmart because we have not had these before. This is new at my Walmart and they're like three bucks cheaper than the other places around me that sell these pizzas. So I like the Meatless Meat Lovers one. It's only like $6.95 or something at Walmart, which is awesome <laughs> compared to just like 10 bucks at all the other places I can find it. Iced tea, I'm a definitely a tea drinker. The uh, pasta I wanted, I wanted some macaroni, macaroni, um, just like macaroni elbows, but they were out, so they replaced it with some rotini, which is fine. This is all just whole wheat pasta, penne, and two rotini ones. Yeah, a can of coconut milk, and my favorite little vegetable bouillon. This is better than bouillon um, seasoned vegetable base. Super duper yummy. It's just like a paste that you put in the water instead of like a bouillon cube. So you can like kind of customize how much of it you want. It's really nice. A package of gnocchi. We've been into that lately. It's like a super easy quick dinner. Got two massive bags of frozen broccoli. I go, I go through broccoli like crazy like it's nobody's business i eat a lot of broccoli so i always have to have a backup bag of that got some brown rice regular old uh hamburger burger buns Back into an Aldi bag, we have grapes. I love getting my produce from Aldi. It's just so much cheaper. Sometimes it is like super ripe and you need to eat it like really quick, but it's just so much cheaper than getting it elsewhere. Bananas, the boys love bananas. Apples, the boys have been really into apples lately. They go through phases with apples. Sometimes we'll buy a bag and they will sit around for like weeks and other times they'll go through them in just a few days. Pancake syrup, just the yucky corn syrup kind. Brown sugar for baking. Garlic, always have to have some garlic. Two bags of tortilla chips, because like I said, I am a chips and salsa, and then I also got that guacamole kind of girl. 
big old thing of vegetable oil and a container of oats. I always like to have backups for my oats. Some Fruit Loop style cereal, off-brand Fruit Loops for the boys. Aaron was pretty excited when he saw that I picked this one up and put it in the cart. Some bread, so my husband likes the whole grain white, so that's for him, and then me and the boys eat wheat, whole wheat bread. Some tin foil. Gushers, I am a fan of Gushers. Got some Big Newtons for the boys because we haven't had those in a while. They enjoy eating those as like a little snack, a little cookie treat. Big tortillas and small tortillas. We were running low on those. These are another thing that we like always have in the house. A couple of avocados. They were 97 cents, which is a good deal these days. So I had to get those. That other box of rotini. More bread, the white and the wheat for to make everybody happy. All right, here's some snacks. We got barbecue potato chips for my husband and an extra bag of tortilla chips for myself, just as an emergency, extra bag. Sausages for my husband. He felt that he needed these. Tofu, recently my Aldi finally started carrying tofu, so that's always nice. Milk for my husband, some more vegan hot dogs for the kids, some salami for my husband, and this is maybe the most exciting part of the whole haul, guys. These are earth grown vegan ice creams, and I've heard that these were available, but I had not seen them at any of the Aldi's around us. And then I was just like looking through the bins today and I saw these and I was like, holy crap, I was so excited. I was literally so excited. So there's vanilla cookie chip, chocolate, and this one is cold brew made with oat milk. They all are made with oat milk. So I'm super excited to try these. Got my own little sausages. These Gardein breakfast sausage patties are delicious. Gardein never disappoints. These are super awesome. Another little Gardein bowl. Like if I just don't have time or energy or want to make a big lunch, I'll just throw this in the microwave. So it's an Italian sausage and pasta bowl. It is a small serving. It's only like 350 calories, but it was super yummy last time I had it. So I got it again. Hawaiian punch. I like to drink Hawaiian punch and the boys drink it too. And lastly, a bunch of soy milk. I got three organic original soy milks. We will use this in any kind of cooking or baking that we need to use milk in so that both me and my husband can eat it and the boys. And then um, we will mix this like Mostly this with like a couple tablespoons of chocolate soy milk or chocolate almond milk or whatever for the boys and that little tiny bit of chocolate helps them drink their milk. So they do end up using these to mix with the chocolate milks. But yeah, I don't really drink a lot of milk anymore. Like I might have it in cereal or with granola or whatever, but I just, I don't know. I'm not really into it as much as I used to be when I drank like cow milk. So yeah, that's it for today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know what other kind of videos you wanna see here on this channel or any other topics that you would like to hear my opinion on. Please leave your comments down below. I love hearing from you guys and I will talk to you next time. Bye.